Okay, so this is just a quick example of using the quotient rule. So I want to take the derivative with respect to t of e to the t over t squared plus one. Um, so this is the quotient of two functions. We can use the quotient rule. Uh, just recall that the derivative uh, d dt of, of f times g is f prime times g minus g prime times f all over the bottom function squared. Okay, so that's from the last video. So in this, in this example, um, oh, sorry, this is the derivative of f over g. The derivative of f over g is this, the quotient rule. So in this, in this example, the function f, the numerator is e to the t, the function g, the denominator is t squared plus one. So this is, by the quotient rule, this is the derivative of the top, so e to the t, times the bottom function. I'll write it in parentheses like this, so it's clear I'm just taking the derivative of the top, minus the derivative of the bottom times the top function all divided by the bottom function squared. So e, uh, so t squared plus one squared. Okay, and now to compute this, we just need to actually take these derivatives. And so this is the derivative of e to the t is itself. So it's e to the t times t squared plus one minus the derivative of t squared plus one is two t plus zero. So it's minus two t times e to the t. And the whole thing is just divided by t squared plus one squared. And that's it, this is the derivative.